I am here in the middle of nowhere. Hey everybody, welcome to a Saturday no afternoon chat. I'm back. I'm back for a week. I thought I would make a little video for you all. Just catch it up on all of our favorite stars since I've been in and out this summer. I don't even know what's going on. But troubled reality star Mama June Shannon is selling her maid over home for $225,000. It's gone an extreme makeover. Uh, TMZ reported the house was a bad way just a few short weeks ago. And June Shannon's troubled boyfriend Gino Doak drove his SUV into the home while intoxicated. And August home video Shannon and Doak filmed during a yard sale showed the home in total disarray. Uh, is that all this, ooh, no dingy dingy at me, is that all that this is about? Okay, so she's selling her house, but then, and then, and then, and then, and we missed this a few days ago, Mama Jude and Gino face judge in Crackdown. Mama Jude BF still fired up after hurling slurs at the media. June and Gino just walked out of court after facing the judge. Their plea hearing was set on Thursday. Sounds like we know what the plea they'll enter. Based on what Gino shouted after exiting the courthouse, June, by the way, was still not in the mood to talk with anyone. Uh, ooh, is this a video? Let's watch the video. I like the TMZ video. Maybe, if it'll load. Mama Jude is finally, oh, here we go. Oh, they're gonna make me watch an ad. I deserve better than this, but the ad might be worth it. Hi, Ollie, say hi to Ollie, everybody. I forgot he's back there. Let's hear the expletives. yelling expletives. I don't hear any expletives in there, but anyway, he's, you know. Uh, they're in no mood to talk when they marched into the courthouse. Gino stepped out of their SUV, fire yelling, what up, pussies, effing queers. Meanwhile, June was bundled up under a hood as Gino offered a hearty F off to our photog. You'll recall the couple's busted, yada, yada, yada. So yeah, June's still all fudged up. She's going to court. She's still hanging with Gino. Hopefully he's got something for her. I don't know what he has. He must have something down there, if you know what I'm talking about, to keep her happy. Just stick around to that asshole. Jill Duggar and Derek Dillard screwed Jim Bob and his rules. Our kids are going to college. Jill Duggar and Derek Dillard, Derek Dillard are providing once again that they do not play by their family's rules. Of course, because we are everyday, ordinary citizens, we support their rebellious behavior. But someone, anyone, please go get Michelle and Jim Bob a wet cloth. Um... They have intense rules set on their 19 children. Besides no hugging before marriage, no celebrating Halloween, and no dancing, they are also expected to not further their education by going to college. While most parents get angry or frustrated at their child for not wanting to attend school, Michelle and Jim Bob's parenting skills are rather different and very outdated. They believe that their homeschooling is enough to get the job done, which wouldn't necessarily be a bad thing if they didn't draw the line at learning outside of their walls. It's honestly sad that Jim Bob and Michelle are so committed to raising their children by these weird standards that they're willing to jeopardize their children's futures. But when it comes to Jill and Derek Duggar, well, it actually sounds like they may want to the best, best for their kids. Um, in a new Instagram post, um, Derek, a fan asked Derek if he and Jill's son Samuel and Israel will, prob will head to college one day, to which he responded, probably. Oh, 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 so shocking. That's hard to hear. Hard to hear the kids get a better himself by going to college. I mean, it's a, the he, I can see the key should go to college, but the wife, no. She's expected to stay home and pop out the babies. I haven't shaved for like a week, everybody, so sorry if there's any fuzzies in there showing off. And great news, Little People, Big World's Amy Roloff is engaged to Chris Merrick. I'm thrilled. Okay, we don't even really need to read this article. Fantastic. 
then Matt can still go bang the assistant, in which they're probably soon get married. And last but not least, our girl Caitlyn Jenner is more confident now than ever ahead of her 70th birthday. She feels blessed. Nothing can bring Caitlyn Jenner down. The former athlete, 69, is looking and feeling her best these days, so it's safe to say she's living her best life. She feels blessed to have had work from the finest surgeons and feels more confident now than she ever had since the transition. Uh, yeah. Nah, for 70, she's looking pretty hot. But we learned last time, which is like two weeks ago, that she still has her man parts, which is very interesting. Very interesting, but, you know, good for her. But go, Caitlin, go. So, yeah, that's all I have to talk about today. Really, it's the biggest thing is that Mama June is still getting in trouble. She's white trash and she's in trouble, y'all. All right, hey, have yourself a great Saturday, and... I'll probably see you all next weekend. You may I'm keep your foul bye, mouth everybody. to yourself. I'll be glad to help you, but you don't need to talk to me like that. I don't deserve it. 